Here we go, folks. Testing my new thing. I just got these items like corner weights for uh, for waiting the car. It's Proform corner weight system. So I, you can see. These are all turned on. I was anxious to see what the weight of this car is because I'm saying forever that I hope this car will be under 800 kilos. And today we'll finally see if I achieved that goal. Okay, let's go around. Check if those these are all on and if we have the right ones. See and the last one. I put uh, the metal plates under all these perform scales. You can see it here, so there won't be any distortion in metal and not getting like a uh, housing of the scale touching this. Okay, everything is inside and outside except the dashboard that has like. Uh, uh, 1.8 kilo so you can see steering wheel is here so everything except dashboard is inside okay now let's see the result of this scale okay this is what we have now so I'm under 800 so my goal to start this is achieved so in the future it will get probably carbon fiber doors fenders uh, bumpers side skirts uh, it will get the mugen wing and the apr ring on the back so that will add some weight but all other carbon fiber parts will be like down with the weight so I will still probably be under 800 kilos with this car and around uh, 240 to 50 horsepower with this one so probably pretty good uh, turn per horsepower ratio that's what I wanted so we can go check under the car see that the scales are not touching anything so let's go check under the car yeah it's a bit mess here working all the time so let's check the scale Number one, yep, not touching anything. Okay, let's see another one. Okay, let's see, this one is okay also. So another one. The rear wheels. Ok. 
Okay. See just some skills. And the last one. So these plates are working fine, being strong enough to support just the scale. How oh, does this car look under? Let's see. Whoop. Engine. Okay. Looking like this. And into too small exhaust. Lots of custom made things here. As you can see, it uh, we boxed this tunnel to get uh, the sitting right so I have like 3 inch exhaust can go here easy so in the future this tank will be removed and then here we will have straight pipe and going on here and my dented back box this will have to be fixed so looks like this right now yeah, it's a little dark but, yep. here performance brake lights everywhere skunk 2 LCS we have uh, motor racing sway bar and the exhaust is just barely missing everything so yeah it's a nightmare we have KW suspension version 3 on this car for now but we'll probably be changing it for racing for something more car uh, for more race oriented thing custom made traction bar because it didn't clear the AT damper so I used the full race bars for now but maybe we will change it because of this problem this is like a project for we have like M factory ball joints wheel wood brakes what do we have? See, yep, everything is renovated. Have BC motor header here, exhaust header, and space for oil cooler. Let's see, this will here we will have like external thermostat for oil and the pipes will go all the way in front so that's it let's go up dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I'll check the weight for last time oh. It's not so totally accurate now because uh, diagonal and side to side scales are not properly aligned, but the total should be the right one. So, yeah, and big thanks to Tegiva Imports for sponsoring me and getting me these scales. So, thank you guys, good one, okay, and to end with that custom carbon fiber glass top with my logo on it. Yep. That's it for now, take care folks, bye.